Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed Al Nayan has been elected as the new president of the United Arab Emirates. This has solidified his rule over the OPEC oil producer and a key regional player that is the UAE. A federal supreme council elected, Al Nayan, the council constitutes of rulers of the seven emirates of the UAE Federation. The move comes a day after the demise of President Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed, who was also Al Nayan's half brother. Al Nayan becomes president at a time when the UAE's long standing times with the United States have been stained. The UAE is a trade and tourism hub. It has deepened its ties with Russia and China. The Biden administration has tried to mend ties with Saudi Arabia and the UAE. Both have refused to take sides in the Russia-Ukraine conflict. Now, Indian Prime Minister Narendra Modi wished the new UAE president. He expressed confidence that under his leadership, India and UAE will continue to deepen their comprehensive strategic partnership. Now, Vice President of India will also visit the UAE. He will offer condo condolences to the UAE leadership following the demise of Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayan. British Prime Minister Boris Johnson will also travel to the UAE to pay respects on behalf of his government. In a statement, Johnson had said that he was deeply saddened by the demise of Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayan. He said he will use the visit to reinforce the close bond between UK and the UAE. United Arab Emirates President Sheikh Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayan was laid to rest in Abu Dhabi. The ruler of Abu Dhabi Emirates died on Friday at the age of 73 after a years long battle with illness. His death triggered a peri period of mourning in the state. Sheikh Khalifa took over as the UAE's second president in November of 2004.